All right. Greenhouse devastation video. Look at that. Yeah, that's a... Yeah, I'll, I'll get over there. Okay, let's start on this side. Over here where the tomatoes were. I say were because, well, most of them no longer have leaves. They looked like that. Now they look like this. All that over there is mint and basil that we have to harvest. I let the mint grow like that on purpose so I can get all those seeds. Yeah, I know the mint seeds are going down. Da, 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 da. I don't mind. Um, yeah. So we have a couple tomatoes that made it. That one. And that one. Those are the only tomatoes that made it. I don't even know how they held down. Those are some troopers. Um, this is our butterfly pea bush. I already picked all the butterfly peas. If I hadn't, y'all would have seen it was completely blue, full of flowers. Um, these were my long red beans. As you can tell, they're not long. Well, they're long, but they're not red anymore. Um, oh, this one was the one that tripped me out. Great gone. So we're just going to be digging this one up, I think. Um, Calendula. It was full. It is now gone. My my whole tarragon is just gone. But my stevia survived. We got a watermelon over here that did not survive. We got more watermelon vines, but no watermelons in there. So, another tomato that did not survive. My rose bushes did not. They, they look rough, y'all. Oh, horseradish. We're going to go ahead and get those roots out soon. Might as well just go on and get them. So, I can't even, I mean, I can get over there by the okra, but there's no need because there is a pole on top of everything over there. And if you see in the back, those are my peach trees. Used to be. Um... Oh, we got another tomato that survived right there. So, I can't do anything else on this side. So, I'm a, oh, we got one bean, y'all, from our long bean, our bush beans. Look at there. I got one bush bean that survived. Where is it at? There it is. With a snail on the side of the pot. Hmm. Let's see. I can't go around this way, so we'll do clean up. Not right now. I got to process this first. Uh, this storm was kind of emotional. I ain't even going to lie. All the cauliflower, zucchinis, and cucumber stuff gone. But my ginger survived, kind of. Cauliflower, I don't know what they're doing. I have no idea what they're doing with their life. Carrots gone. Okra gone. Just weeds. Whew. My turmeric is flourishing. I got mint that I have to harvest over here. My zinnias are good. My lemongrass looks alright, I guess. My peppers are all gone. They blew off. They're somewhere. I hope something's eating them or can eat them. Who knows? All that back there at the back is mint. Yeah, I know. We got to harvest it. My guava trees. Done. Done. I don't even know if they'll come back from this. But everything. Oh, one of my persimmons. I mean, pomegranates. The leaves just gone. But the other one still has leaves. Go figure. And they're right next to each other. Ah. 
my miracle berry looks beautiful but it didn't get any berries this year so i'm hoping for next year kiwi kind of okay we got more citrus trees over here our sweet potatoes we're gonna go ahead and dig these up early they're big enough to dig up let me see yeah here we go so there's a sweet potato i think we're gonna go ahead and get them early because well let me tell y'all right now surprisingly the one thing that said yes hurricane helene yes i love you my roselles look at that look at that oh yeah calamondin's making a resurgence they got um fruit gosh dog if you don't leave me alone mosquito but yeah um our figs we had figs but we've been finding figs all over the greenhouse so i guess that means we don't have figs anymore um look at these roselles aren't, aren't they gorgeous look at that look we'll be out here later to get them you know that's what you use for tea for high blood pressure and stuff all right other trees they kind of look okay i can't get all the way over there to the olive tree and the other stuff over there um pears and stuff i can't get over there so probably not today but tomorrow maybe we'll be out here like i said this is kind of emotional I don't know if y'all have been following our channel, but even just seeing me from the beginning, look at there. Even just seeing me from the beginning, starting to garden and do everything to now. Some of these plants have been with me for three or four years. Some of these trees have anyway, been with me for three or four years. It's kind of depressing to look at the garden like this kind of makes me want to cry i can't even lie <sighs> oh kind of makes me want to cry because y'all know this is my baby we worked on this thing you know i took pride in this i know it's not as bad as you would think it is but to me it's bad so yeah garden leaves everywhere we got a, a lot of cleaning to do